What's up, Yano? We're back for another cheesesteak review. Today, we're at Delco Steaks over in Broomall, and we bought the boy LP with us. Yes, sir. He has not been in a video in a while, so, you know, it's great. It's great to have him out here. LP, First cheesesteak review. I'm excited. LP, tell, tell the people what you've been got going on since they last saw you. Uh, so, yeah, I've been uh, going to college down at Drexel, a few streets away from my boy, Jan. Uh, life's good. Got a job. Uh, trying to get in a few more videos now that I got some time on my hands. So. He wants to be in more videos. Yeah. So, you guys, this is an audition for Liam. Let me know what you guys think of him. Um, as always, please remember to hit that subscribe button. Liam's hungry. I'm hungry. We're going to try these cheese steaks out. They look absolutely off the chain. I'm not going to lie. Uh, that was American? They used shredded American? Is that what it was? They used some sort of shredded cheese on these, which kind of surprised me. But they got the seeded rolls. Always a banger. Oh, man, I'm hot. Yeah, that's how, that's how <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Damn, it's a little messy. I said that. You ready for first bite? <laughs> you want to take yeah, this first bite? Right. Mm. That's actually really hot. Cheese is like mac and cheese and like. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. I feel that. I feel that. So. For my first two bites, the thing that stands out the most, besides the cheese, obviously that was jumping right at me, is the meat. The flavor of this meat is off the chain. Like honestly, this is some of the most flavorful meat I've ever tried. Um, the cheese, it is very, it, it's almost weird. I mean, this is definitely American. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't expect it to be shredded like that though. I've never seen that, um, but it actually, seems to be blending well with the meat um, usually you'll get like the cheese on top and then you won't really get to have it blended in with the meat but this this is like perfectly integrated with the meat yeah I definitely the first thing you notice is the cheese when you bite in yeah but then the flavor comes back in with the, the meat the, <laughs> the steak comes in you see good flavor at that you know what I'm saying? Stumble with my words a bit there. It's all good. Seated roll as well. Mm -hmm. I'm a big fan. This roll isn't really popping out at me as, as I thought it would. It's still good. Um, there's just a lack of... A lack of real pop mm -hmm. um, with the roll. But other than that, it's real solid. Uh, I understand the signs. You know, best of Philly, number one. It's not technically Philly though, it's Delco. Yeah, this is Delco. This is Delco Steaks. But um, yeah, with the roll, I've had this once before. The roll's a little more firm. This time it's a little... So I used to some inconsistency there. But it's a good little, all around, good cheese. This is my first time trying it, guys. Liam has already tried it once, so he has some of his own opinions on it. I would say as far as um, bang for your buck, this was what, 15, 13? I'm gonna pay $13.60. $13.60. Pretty bang for your buck. You're getting a. Uh... Let me show you guys. You're getting a pretty healthy cheesesteak, relatively speaking. I'm not gonna yeah, lie. Exactly. There is there is a lot of meat in there. Um, I do the uh, slice, not the ground up. I'm also a big slice guy, but yeah, you're getting a lot of meat. This is a good bang for your buck. You wanna rate it? You ready to, you ready to rate it? I'm that? gonna finish my half. I don't know. Do you have a few more bites in? I will say, I wish I had a little more onion. Yeah, I am noticing that. Um, I would say they did, they did well on two of the three facets um, of the cheesesteak. They definitely got the cheese and the meat pretty, pretty spot on, pretty good. The onions are lacking, and to me personally, while the onions aren't the most critical part, uh, the onions still play a crucial role in the cheesesteak. You typically get ketchup on yours. I'm not a big ketchup guy, honestly. Sometimes I get it. I feel like if they ask me for ketchup, then I'll get ketchup. But like, if they don't ask, I'm not gonna say put ketchup on it. Cause I feel like that's their own style, you know? Mm -hmm. Like if they're asking somebody if they want ketchup, then a lot they of people must get, ketchup. yeah, a lot of people must get ketchup, so. 
That's just my thoughts, but I think Petro Bouncy just makes the cheesesteak more sloppy, um, which makes my job more difficult, so. Yeah, I think I'm ready to get some ratings in. You go first, I go first, I will do this. Um, you, do you have a number in your head? You got the official Peterson ranking. Drama's building. Mm -hmm. He's taking his time with this one, too. Get my final bite and see if anything changes. I'm really thinking about it. Delco Steaks. My last rating on you has changed. I'm giving you an 8-2. Eight, 8-2? Two. Eight, two. Look at that. That's solid. It's a good cheesesteak. Very good cheesesteak. Now listen. I almost never give out 9. I will say this. This cheesesteak, if they stepped up their onion game a little bit more, definitely in the nine range, I'm gonna go with um, eight five. Five, all eight, right. Five. I like so that. pretty, pretty consistent rankings. Yeah, let's we, bump mine up to an eight three. He's gonna bump nice up. He's gonna bump up to an eight three, eight three, eight five. So pretty, pretty consistent. But yeah, this is a solid cheesesteak. Good bang for your buck. I would recommend you guys try this cheese stick out. Um, I know it's a little bit out the way, all the way in Delco, but still. If you're in the area, stop by. They got three locations too. So they also have three locations. Yeah, we wanted to go to the original. But yeah, as always, if you guys enjoyed the video, please remember to hit that like button. And then also guys, super important, remember to go out and vote. Vote, yes. If you guys want change, I don't care who you vote for, uh, just go out and vote. Not everyone's got that right. Going, it is true. Questions. So, you guys stay safe. I hope to see you next time. Peace. Go Avalanche. Yeah. Or just say go Avalanche.